guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 4 of season 4 of Don Machi. So it's gonna get started in 3, 2, 1, go. She's gonna be on the other side. Oh, yeah! <laughs> She's <laughs> That's so fucking cute. <laughs> Okay, I have to start watching this on Thursdays because this is getting ridiculous because of the fact is, like, okay, when I come home, because now I'm working eight hours, not five, I am tired because officially on Friday, I didn't get home until like seven-ish. I got there at 11 in the morning and I was already still tired for the previous night and such, but I have to make a goal to get this shit done on Thursday. I cannot do Sundays anymore because of the fact is... If I, especially with the fact is that I now have to work on Sundays, and if we're starting that next week, I literally can only come home and record the Sunday shit and not this. So, Deja, we <laughs> to when I get home on Thursdays, no matter how tired I am, I gotta watch it. And because of the fact is he wants me there at 11 now, and most of these shows come out between 12, like, it's... If you could only imagine, it's super hard, but the biggest thing is I have to, like, fight laying my ass down. No, nah, she's friendly. Right? Ah, uh, yeah. She's not gonna grow legs, is she? Okay. My phone would go off again. I can't get off. <laughs> Whatever, I don't give a shit. Oh. 
I literally thought I turned off all my alarms for recording! Hell, I need to start turning my 11 one off, you know, since I've worked fucking Sundays. That is literally going to be in the whole freaking thing. <laughs> I am sorry to anyone who hears the alarm in the background. Phone, shut up. Alexa, make an announcement. What's the announcement? Mom, can you come get my phone for me, please? Announcing. Mom, can you come get my phone for me, Thank you, mommy. <laughs> Can I have that? Hello? Is this news, buddy? Nobody's there. I know, it was a snooze. It was the alarm. Oh, okay. It's broken. Thank you.
Yeah, is it just you? Oh my god. We are going into another lonely episode. First pretty cure and now no. First pretty cure, then made, now this. <laughs> Devil's a part time where you go have a lonely episode too. <laughs> Something's coming. Oh, fucking crabs. Are they gonna survive this? Like, honestly? Is she just Aquaman type ish on this? Okay. Okay. Yeah, please just don't look back. I mean, if you trip, fall, like, that's on you. Nobody's helping you up because, like, if it was me, I'd be like, I love you, but fuck that. I ain't dying for you. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Mm. The 
question is, is he gonna make it in time? Is that a fucking whale? That's a big ass fish. Hey, but it looked like a whale. Are you kidding me, show? <laughs> Excuse me. Uh. There's no fucking end to this. None. <laughs> What the f- WHAT?! <laughs> oh my god. the time to argue. <laughs> right? I mean, you know, but yes, they hold me own. <gasps> Baby. I mean, you could carry her, but, uh, uh, huh.
Why does the sword look like the sword from Xenoblade Chronicles, even though I've never played Xenoblade Chronicles? I've only seen, like, trailers and such. I mean, seriously, was it just me? Or is it everyone else? <laughs> See, now, now I feel like I'm going to watch Nico B. Please. I, it's going to happen! <laughs> <sighs> the situation on how to hear me? They're about to cut it right when she does something. I know this show. What the fuck did I just say? What did I say? What did I say? The OK of OK movers <laughs> coming on a Thursday. Like, oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, the episode was good. Maddie, she kind of reminds me, and I cannot believe, like, initially with the way she fell and she was, like, scared to, you know, continue on and help Belle. I cannot believe I'm about to say this because, like, instantly when I, like, read the captions and stuff, and I'm like, oh. So you're that type. She's fucking Kaede from Bunny Girl Senpai and with Kaede's situation and her story. Like, she is scared and she's like, no, I don't want to go out. I'm too scared and venture out. I want to stay here where it's safe because I don't want to die. But in the end, like, she goes and it's just so fucking cute. I, I just, I, I need this child to get some legs, though. Please, I mean, she a damn mermaid. Give her a moment when she has legs. Hell, you made freaking little Miss Laura, aka Hestia from Tropical Rouge Pretty Care, finally get some freaking legs when that show is airing. So, you know, you could just do with this. But something tells me that she would have to sacrifice a lot more. I don't think it would be like the, like Disney Little Mermaid or even Grimm's brother Little Mermaid where it's like, yeah, you know, hey, you gotta probably kill Belle. <laughs> That's not gonna happen. Um, but something tells me, yeah, she has to probably make like a sacrifice or some ish, maybe for her to get legs. Or it could just be like, okay, yeah, she's never gonna get legs. But it does make me wonder with, cause we're, we're still at the beginning of the show, which still baffles me. Because I think with the way these episodes, uh, I can't speak, oh god. The way these episodes are going, I, I was expecting it to be like, it feels like we're on episode six and such with the way they're going and such. Um, but then when we get to episode six, it's probably going to feel way different to me. <laughs> Who knows? But, like, it, I, I'm hoping that Marie and Belle eventually meet up with everyone else because they are close to them. And I was expecting to see it in today's episode. But y'all was like, no, no, it's not time. We got to wait probably one more week. Um, I'm not mad at it if I have to wait a week, but you know, two is kind of pushing it if you do it, so, um, don't do it. Show. I'm warning. <laughs> I'm just saying, because, like, yes, I do love it when shows, like, um, overstretch something, but when, there's always a moment or, like, a line between overstretching it and then overstretching it, like, hugely and such, um... And I don't want that to be like, I don't want to be on episode six. And then because it is a big ass cave where they are and there's multiple areas that they have to explore because yes, my babies are looking for the, you know, 
back to the surface while Belle is looking for them. And let's say one wrong freaking turn and then we don't know where the heck we are. That's what I feel like is going to happen. Hell, I was expecting Belle to meet them when they were all surrounded by all the damn monsters. But no, it's okay. It's all right. Mm -hmm. But I just need, I need to see what, how, well, because no, I think what the trailer, because it's been a while since I've seen the trailer. The trailer showed what Haruhime just did, is about to do. But wasn't that also focused on like season, was it two? Because Haruhime, no, Haruhime was the main focus of, Three? No. We Weene and the Zenos were the focus of season three. Harahime was season two. Yes? Yes? I think so. I think so. We'll, we'll go with that. I'll look it up after I watch um part time. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction for this episode four of season four of Don Machi. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys on Thursday. I promise. I freaking promise. <laughs> For episode five. Bye, guys.